for your interest in IDERA's Precise for SAP. This is a solution for SAP landscape performance management. It's user focused. It reveals the application code and it's server aware. The yeah, we believe that ultimately Precise for SAP provides better visibility for better outcomes. Let's take a look at what ha happens. Uh, we'll, um, we'll actually cover the process of managing end, the end user experience. Um, precise, you know, everybody has tools, but what they don't have is context. This is kind of our secret sauce. And this is basically just connecting uh, the dots across the SAP landscape. Um, we do have uh, capture a lot of information. It can be you know, kind of summarized for different uh, use of different stakeholders, including the technical experts, and we have a couple of case studies. This video is really about just kind of whetting your appetite, kind of giving you a sense if you'd like to learn more. And we definitely invite people who want to know more to uh, re request a meeting. So uh, with that, let's go ahead and take, take a look at um, our high-level overview. No question about it, SAP is a very complicated application, a minimum of six technologies, numerous end users. How do you know if an end user is having a problem? When they do have a problem, where is it? How do you minimize staff time so that everybody doesn't go, you know, chasing after, you know, an issue? And so you can see here all the, the technology stack is interdependent and it's complex. Now, what typically happens is an end user tries to do something. Meanwhile, all the great people in IT are unaware until the end user self-reports. And that's kind of a problem right off the bat. Then what can happen is you have kind of an expensive, time-consuming, and frustrating process of people looking at the application stack, but they only look at a subset of what's going on. And it's very difficult with just that subset view to answer who, what transaction, where in the application stack is the issue. To solve this, what Precise does is it connects the dots. And so that end user transaction starting in the browser, connection through portal into NetWeaver, into your ABAP code, down into the database, and we support Oracle, SQL Server, Sybase, and DB2, and into storage, we capture metadata about this transaction. And it basically tells us what user, what location, what transaction they're executing, how much the times the total transaction take, and then every step along the way. And that information is continuously pulled into our historic repository that we call the Performance Management Database. That becomes a single sheet of music for everybody to be able to look at and see what's going on. Now, this is kind of some feedback from customers, is they basically said that in the past, everybody would open up their own tool and we chase our tail, but with Precise, we're able to find the issue quickly. So, how do we do it? When an issue comes up, we basically have uh, alerting, so we can basically let people know that there's a performance issue. So you can actually do end user experience SLAs, and then you can open up Precise, and Precise shows all of the transactions, which ones did not meet the SLA, who was impacted, and then where within the application stack is the issue. Now, in this case, you enable the DBA to go in on the very SQL statement that's slowing down the transaction. So please consider who, what transaction, where within the application stack on one screen. So it, it definitely, Precise definitely helps you minimize time to resolution. And so that's a very key metric for a performance solution. We also have detailed information. Many people run at least a portion of the SAP landscape on VMware, and so we can we'll actually track virtualization events and let you know when there is contention and the hypervisor is not providing adequate resources to a guest VM that is serving your application. 
So we're not going to go through all of these. This is that high level. So just a real quick, you know, kind of getting back to business quickly. Let's just take a quick look at assessing ECC performance. So let's drill in here. When we go to a screen, we're actually looking at uh, four systems. This bottom system we have highlighted, you can see that the average response time is less than half a second. And with 286 million transactions, it's quite busy. Over here, we show details about what this system is doing. The y-axis is response time. The x-axis is time across the day. For the time frame that we have dialed in here, these are the outlier transactions. We sort all of the T codes by response time. So these are your outliers. You're also able to go into activity and filter by work type. So here we're looking at the dialog transactions. This stack bar graph, the different tiers are client, uh, queue time, ABAP time, database time. Down here are the transactions that drove this profile. And I'm able to click on a transaction and then filter and reveal the end users that exercise that transaction. Now these transactions are sorted by weighted response time. So this is a very heaviest user. On top of the, the screenshot, basically added in a red box to basically focus on users that not only have a heavy accumulated resource consumption, but have slow average response time. And so those were kind of some of the users that we're going to focus on in particular. So like we mentioned, end user focus, technology oriented. I can easily see what's going on. Just to show you, I can also evaluate a custom report that had been developed. Once again, who are the users from weighted response time as well as who have very high average response time. So there's a bunch of different ways to slice and dice. We can answer questions about network issues, client, ABAP code, database issues. I think the database is one of the areas where IDERA really stands out. So that's our brief introduction. And as I said right at the opening, we definitely, for interested parties, we definitely invite you to uh, request a demo where we can discuss this further and see if Precise for SAP can help you manage your SAP landscape. Thank you. <laughs>